Mr. Speaker, this week our government is continuing to implement year two of our economic action plan. We're continuing to protect today's jobs and create the jobs of tomorrow. And the Liberal leader can't stand it. Last year he bet against the Canadian economy so he could force an unwanted and unnecessary election. And now that the economy is in recovery, he can't be bothered with our jobs and growth budget. That's why he has set out on his tax and spend roadshow. Because what the Liberal re leader really wants to talk about are huge spending promises and higher taxes. But Canadians know that higher taxes kill jobs, and a March break lecture won't change that. When the Liberal leader chooses his tax and spend roadshow over the work of this House, he proves what we've been saying all along. The Liberal leader isn't in for Canadians, he's just in it for himself. Thank you. Thank you.